2011 proved surprisingly a, a rather good year. People were a little bit afraid, notably in the summer, about a possible slowdown following some turmoil about the Eurozone. But actually, we delivered a very solid second half. So at the end, we recorded a ma magnificent growth rate, 11.4%. We reached 9.7 billion euro of revenue, close to 10 billion. I hope we will get there soon. And we achieved a better than expected margin progression. We reached an operating margin of 7.4%. That's better than what we expected. That's a solid performance, the best for several years. And I think we ended the year with a very solid margin for the second half, which gives us a good entry point in 2012. The market is overall moving pretty fast. There are major domains which are commoditizing, which means that the customer mainly pays attention to the cost of the service, which requires big investment in industrialization and very cost-effective platforms, notably offshore. And then there is a huge domain of innovation, of new things, where we launch new offering, new service line, and where we leverage our advanced alliances. We launched a big focus on group offering in 2009, and we launched what we call our top-line initiative, which are big effort of the overall group. Where we have now conquered a, a leadership position is about business information management. We recently won key deals in large multinationals where we displaced very powerful incumbents. I think of Unilever, I think of Deutsche Telekom. Uh, so BI is booming. Testing is another strength of the group, and I think uh, the industry analysts rate us as number one worldwide. And we launched recently some new offering. And most recently, we launched a big one where I think we will have a big success, which is mobility. You know, all these uh, smart devices, intelligent mobile phones, which create huge challenge for information system. Capgemini is essentially about people. Uh, salary cost represents 60% of our cost, so it's a people business and only people business, and very qualified people, of course. We are voluntarily a first employer of young graduates. So we live with some natural attrition to people turnover, but we must focus on recruiting young people, young graduates that we train, where we are kind of post-training, post-university first employer. So now, last year, we put a big focus on young recruits. They were 42% of all our recruits, and we grew everywhere. We grew onshore, we grew offshore, so that at the end of the year, the group headcount is very close to 120,000 people. When 120,000 people can combine the strengths of personal values that help them achieve their personal goals in life, and the strengths of a collective body, that's pretty unique. The group has been built from its origin on very individualistic values. Because I don't know many groups that celebrate freedom as a value, celebrate modesty as a value or honesty. And when Serge Kahn designed that, he had in mind that everybody should fulfill its own personal ambition and that would be coherent and that by combining these individual strengths and energy, that would build a unique collective body, a unique company. The group has proved its resilience in 2008 and 2009, when the market really slowed down. The market demand was quite solid at the end of 2011, but in a few geographies and segments. The market conditions have been constant since. Now we're in front of a turbulent market where there are rapid changes, so we must show agility. There are questions about 2012 overall, notably in Europe. So it's a market that is probably better than what people feared, but that can be turbulent. That requires prudence, vigilance and agility. People matter. Results count.